Hi everyone and welcome back to Aquatic Cloud Food. So today I'm going to be hatching some fairy shrimp eggs. Now how we're going to do this is quite simple. I'm going to take you through two options of how you can do it firstly with fresh water and then obviously second option is salt water with the culture salts. So what we'll need is 500 mils of spring water We'll need the fairy shrimp eggs, and I have two capsules here, so for two different options. I have my culture salts for the salt water option. And lastly, I have a container of some kind. Now, as I did with the previous video with the Daphne eggs, I put the Daphne eggs into the water, and what that did was the eggs rose to the top. Now, if you did watch that video, you'll notice that the eggs were still dry, that's why they rose to the top. However, if we can slowly let the water be absorbed into the eggs, it can make for a better outcome. So that is why I have my container here. And what we'll be doing is slowly pouring in the water into the container. Okay, so I'm just going to put the camera down so you can see exactly what is happening here. Okay, so... We are going to start with a fresh water option, which is simply just sterile water, bottled water that you can get from the supermarket. I'm going to put one batch of fairy shrimp eggs into the container, as so. And then I've been told to just slowly add water. Now I'm just going to put an approximate amount in here just to cover them. So as you can see, the eggs are covered. I'm floating around. I just do a little bit more. And they have a lot of space in this kind of container. So I'm going to let that sit and come back to it and let you know how I go. Okay, so it's been about five minutes and the eggs are floating around quite distributed in this water, which I like. So I'm just going to continue to add a little bit more water and make sure I'm spreading that around, getting them all off the walls of this container and they are nice and evenly distributed here so I'm just going to finish that 500 mils off and let that sit so as for the specifics as for the temperature and everything like that you want to just make sure they're in a pretty cool place in your house so I'd recommend around 20 degrees or 25 is okay so normal house temperature so in a cool area of the house um, filtered sunlight so not direct sunlight but as long as some light is hitting it and you want to just aerate a few times a day at least so whenever you can think of it just pop off the top simple let it aerate for a little bit get the oxygen in and then you can close it back up and put it wherever it needs to be so that is all for now that's the fresh water option i'll be going into the salt water option next thank you guys for watching and i'll see you next time